Good morning everybody. Uh, it is Friday today. I'm having a very kind of like normal home day and I thought I would vlog what I eat in a day because let's face it, the majority of the time it's like me gallivanting around and that's not always what we do so I just thought I'd do almost like a, a boring day. Oh, I hope it's not boring but anyway, um, this is just like a regular day. Loser. You just get really used to vlogging by yourself, don't you? If you ever do that. <laughs> uh, basically, yeah, I'm just gonna vlog today. I'm out by the sea this morning. It's Friday, it's supposed to be the hottest day of the year. Whether that ends up being true or not, we shall see, because it is Ireland after all. Uh, but just follow along with me on my day and see how I eat. Now, um, from my walk, I listen to Radio Nova as per usual, feeding the cats. So this is what I normally do every morning is I go, come back from my walk, I do my stretches outside, and then I come down, I change into my robe, I come down, I feed the cats, and when I feed in the cats, I will take my Simproof, which I talked about in my last What I Eat In A Day video. Basically, it's live bacteria. This is week six, so I wanna see how I'm doing with it. Um, halfway through the program with it. It's definitely making changes, so I'm just gonna lower the radio so I don't get uh, demonetized. Basically, it's a shot. This is mango and passion fruit flavor. It's pretty okay, like. I would say it's ever so slightly vinegary, so it's a bit strange. But you don't have to keep it in the fridge until you open it and then you have to keep it in the fridge. I am getting my big box of it out because that's my sixth one. So this is the box that it comes in. It's very excellent angles, Carla. Uh, I'm gonna put one in the fridge. Sorry, I'm gonna put a fresh one in the fridge now because it, to me, it tastes much better when it's cold. It's a little bit easier to get down. That's one shot. And we'll see, I'm definitely feeling a difference in my guts. <laughs> um, let's say it that way, sorry, very good angles hard to do this with one hand um, it's hard to uh, it's at the start it's a bit hard to get down but honestly it's fine like it's grand it's not a big problem I'm gonna go have a shower now um, and then today I am filming this morning I'm having a morning in the house and then I'm going this afternoon I'll probably take Bronach my son for a walk and he falls asleep when I go for a walk and then I will go to a coffee shop and do a bit of editing and things like that so I'll touch you all in a bit. lowering the radio because otherwise I will get demonetized but I am ready now to film and um, I am doing a two reels and a video this morning and um, I'm nearly finished one reel and I'm about to film another reel hopefully Vincent comes out of the shower and then I'm filming a, another YouTube video so it's all like YouTube video inception this morning I am working on my 800 ml here of water and as soon as I have that I am going to have my coffee and I'm going to show you how I make my coffee in the morning when I'm at home little man is in his bouncer and he's teething at the moment bless his heart so he's dressed like a little pirate today he's so cute I love him so much you okay buddy so I'm going to drink this now 
and that is one of my biggest tips is that water is so 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 important for weight loss it's vital for weight loss um there's a whole science behind it i'll let you guys look it up if you want to yes buddy yes honey there's a lot of me doing that i apologize there's gonna be a lot of me doing that all day uh, water so so important we can't actually lose weight without being properly hydrated so i find it very very difficult to get enough water into me because i prefer coffee so much more so i make a basically a what's the word oh what is the word a um oh yeah um, so basically i make a non-negotiable with myself that i have to drink one of these before i'm allowed water that's absolutely completely just it's non-negotiable i have to do that and then after i have each one i have to drink a good bit of this and that's because my hygienist told me it will help with the staining on my teeth because i drink so much coffee so gonna get this down now i only had like just under half to go so that's finished and i don't refill this until i'm i have uh, emptied it and then i kind of have a good idea of how much i'm drinking and um, we have to use these bottled water because our tap water tastes like chlorine and we are about to get a um, filter machine hopefully installed in the house so that's another 800 mils so when i finish this then i will be 1.6 liters down to the day so hopefully i'll get that down before 12 o'clock get a coffee into me now and i'm going to show you how i make my coffee so i think it's easier if i bring it over is it no easier if I bring you over. Ew. So I have my witch's brew mug and in it I have half, I, I'm using instant coffee at the moment because I don't have a coffee machine and I don't want to use a cafetiere uh, because I it will gone, be gone cold by the time I want to drink it. So I also love flavoured coffee. Um, so I have the Beanie's Caramel Popcorn flavour. This is one of my favourites. Anything kind of caramelly flavour. Uh, I also love the Creamy Caramel. And I love the Sticky Toffee Pudding. Um, the Double Chocolate's not bad. The Hazelnut's not bad. Um, oh, 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 what's happening? Little man having a freak out. Um, and then I use to kind of keep it because it, I, I don't, a little flavour from it goes a long way. I use the lower um, coffee, depending on the time of the day. Are you okay? Depending on the time of day, I'll either use decaf or the classic. Um, I use half a teaspoon of each of those, <laughs> and I have to bounce him to bed uh, to sleep. And then I use three hemorrhoetas because I like it sweet. Typically, I'll use cashew milk, but I don't have any at the moment. And I do, but I have an open thing of oat milk, and I'm not going to waste this. So, uh, oat milk has 59 calories per 100 ml, so I'm going to use 60 ml. Um, I always measure it out, so I know. So, I'm going to use 60 ml of this into my coffee. Stir, stir, stir. And then, for that first drop that hits your soul. Oh, my other son is going to be giving out now. Yeah, okay. Mm. Oh, for coffee. Can you see my other son? My other son. My firstborn. This is my baby boy. My fluffy baby boy. Yes, you are. You're not happy to be sat up here though, are you? No, I love you so much. You need your face clean too. Yes, you do. So as you can see, I'm in high demand this morning. I have no help today, um, so it's a it's an, a tricky day, but we'll we'll get there. We'll get it done. Mwah. Okay, have to go deal with the other son as well. <laughs> I'm joking. I, he's my son. I love him. decided to go for lunch outside today because it's supposed to be the hottest day of the year although it looks like pants outside um so vincent is working from home today so are you doing a poo 
yeah that's the sound we want um this is working from home today so i am going to make us both salads and then we're going to take them and we're just going to go sit by the sea and have them for lunch my salads are basically just a big old pile of vegetables and i'm also going to be putting in the tofu basal uh, basilico by typhoon which is one of my favorite uh, tofu's ever. It is 198 calories per 200 grams, so I'll probably just use half the pack for both of us, and then a pepper each, um, some tomatoes, a load of cucumber, and a bit of um, vegan feta cheese, and some basil. And that is going to be lunch, and I'm very excited for it. So I'm going to put that together now, and I'll show you kind of how I do it. I have the largest dishes today. <laughs> So I'm basically just going to start chopping um, and weighing as I go uh, so I can count the calories and that's it. I'm going to see if I can film this. Might not be able to because my tripod is kind of broken but we shall see. We are home uh, for a while now and I am about to feed the little man and then we're going to go for a walk but I've decided just to have a little snack um, in between so I'm going to have one of my favourite bounce balls. This is the um, maple pecan cashew which is my second favourite after the, the millionaire but for some reason at the moment we can't get the millionaire ones in Ireland so uh, I don't want to say I take credit for that but uh, I take credit for that <laughs> so um, I'm going to eat this now. And then I'm going to feed him and then we're going to go for a walk. Hey, little man and I are back from insomnia. He woke up, so we need to come home. I am ravenous right now. I'm not really sure what I'm gonna have. Um, I think a banana, maybe. Or I might make some yogurt. I might do a, I kind of want something sweet. I might do some plums. Uh, yeah, I might do some plums and yogurt. Mm, my angel. He's so good. Uh, but I'm not really sure. I'll let you know anyway. Okay, I'm going to say hello to everybody. He's saying, oh, yeah, that's a good boy. He's a good boy, Brannock. You're such a good boy. You're so big, aren't you? Yeah. You're in your pirate outfit today. I went with raspberries and Greek yogurt because... I couldn't be bothered making anything because to be honest with you, I'm exhausted. So that'll do. And um, I'm gonna drink some more water because it's gone really warm today. Um, and I'm gonna try and take a lie down with a little man beside me and just rest my body for a while because I'm really tired today. Anyway, I'll see you in a bit. As you can tell, it's the end of the day. I am back, he's kicking away, I'm exhausted. And I'm really, really grateful to meet from two days ago for doing a stir fry. Um, doesn't look amazing, but hopefully it'll taste good. I'm gonna add 
an extra packet of beans and a courgette to it and I'm going to just marinate, do some marinated tofu. So I'm watching the cats, I'm watching Bronach. I We had to go do some shopping because we had no water in the house. Um, so I'm just wrecked. But I'm gonna make this and then I'm gonna eat this. I did have two slices of ham with some cheese, vegan obviously, um, and a banana that I did not get to show you because I was doing all the other things at the same time. But I'm gonna go make this now. And hopefully get it into me in a very short amount of time because we're starving. Okay, we're totally ready. One big plate of vegetables, tofu, crochets, garlic, ginger, coriander, deliciousness. I need to go eat this now before I pass out. And the very last thing I'm having tonight is some Alpro uh, cherry yogurt with raspberries and some little dark chocolate chips. I can't really see that coming. Really. There you go. So I'm gonna go eat this now and watch a little bit more John Oliver and then I have to wash my little man and go to bed.